The gap between futuristic sci-fi movies and the present reality is becoming thinner by the day. Neuralink, Elon Musk's company just had their first real human implanted with their brain chips. So, you know that mind-blowing scene in The Matrix where Neo just plugs into the computer? Well, brace yourself because Elon Musk's Neuralink just pulled off some serious sci-fi magic. They stuck a tiny chip right into a living, breathing human brain. Crazy, right? This mind-blowing experiment went down on January 31st, 2024. But before you go picturing people zipping around on hoverboards using only their thoughts, which would be cool but we're not quite there yet, let's break it down. This isn't some random guy getting a tech upgrade, it's someone dealing with quadriplegia, hoping to regain control through this little wonder called the N1 chip. Imagine moving prosthetics with just a thought and finally breaking free after years of being locked in. It's some seriously powerful stuff. Hold on a sec though, like any good superhero story, there's a twist. This human 2.0 upgrade brings a hefty dose of ethical concerns. What happens when our deepest thoughts become digital whispers, floating around and vulnerable to hackers? I mean, the ability to connect to the internet and any computer device with your mind is cool, but does the inverse apply as well? Can your mind be connected to by any computer and malicious actor? And don't forget the big unknown. Will these brain implants mess with our minds in the long run? Are we talking sci-fi mind control or just a bad headache? The truth is, nobody really knows yet. Neuralink's first human trial, the Prime Study, is just the beginning. They want to see if the N1 chip is safe and actually helps people control stuff with their minds. But before we start dreaming of a cyborg future, let's slow down a bit. It's not just about scientists and tech giants tinkering with our brains. It's about all of us. We need open, honest conversations about this, not just with tech experts, but with everyone. Ethicists, philosophers, even your barista because they deserve a say too. The human brain is a wild and beautiful mystery. As we dive into this brain-computer interface adventure, let's remember that progress isn't just about cool gadgets. It's about using them wisely, ethically, and for the benefit of everyone. Only then can we make sure this human 2.0 inches version isn't some dystopian nightmare, but a genuinely awesome upgrade for all. So let's keep the excitement rolling, but mix in a healthy dose of caution. The future isn't a pre-written script. It's a story we create together, with our minds, our hearts, and a whole lot of responsible thinking. Remember, with great power comes great responsibility, even if that power comes in the form of a tiny chip nestled in your brain. To tell the truth, no one can say for sure at the moment. The Prime Study, Neuralink's first human trial, represents a new level of ambition. They would like to find out if the N1 chip is reliable and does help people operate things with their minds. However, it would be wise to ditch this dream of a cyborg future for some time, it isn't just a matter for the scientists and the big tech companies them playing with our minds, it's about all of us. We must hold public discussions about this, not just with experts of tech, but with anyone. As we come to the end of this video, do not hesitate to like, comment, and share the video. And for those that haven't yet, smash the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified when we post. Cheers!